So, uh, my mom sent me this link, and it's from space.com, and they basically said how to how to see Uranus in the night sky without uh, with the naked eye. It has these cool picture, uh, this cool picture. It has some reference. You can see Mars and Uranus, and I know where Mars is. Uh, so I went outside. I didn't take this picture. This is actually Stephen Bellavia. He took that picture. But I put it up there because I, I, I never actually got a picture of Uranus. But I did get to see Mars. Um, and I actually point up directly with my camera. I can see it right there. It's really bright in the night sky. And you almost can't tell when the transition happens. But right here... No, I guess you can't tell. I switch to the binoculars. And I get this shaky, shaky, shaky video of, of Mars. And, yeah. I, I, I take the video and I go frame by frame later. And I'll show you the best image that I managed to get out of that. So, I wasn't going to leave you with that, though. I went in to my house, to my desk, and I grabbed my microscope lens. Because I don't actually have a lens for my telescope. Because uh, it fell out and broke, which is a shame. So here's my telescope set up. haven't used it in a while. Astromaster 70 Celestron. It's okay. It was a good first telescope. So, uh, I'm clean all these spider webs off. And I put that uh, microscope lens in. If you notice, I have some white tape around the end. Uh, I made a little friction fit because the microscope lens was a little bit too small. And here is Mars through the telescope. It's a little more steady. Just as hard to film though, because I'm lazy. And instead of mounting the camera, I just held it with my hands. Which, uh, it, it probably affected the outcome of the final images. But here they are. This is the one through the telescope. And here's another one to this telescope. This one is from the binoculars. And then I just zoom in a little bit. Yeah. Make of that what you want. But I thought I'd add in this extra little bit. I have access to this microscope. It's not mine. But I thought I'd, I, I prepared some stuff to show you. Uh, this first part, this first piece right here is the smallest smiley face that I could manage to draw. Very, very nice. Uh, next up we have the edge of a razor. Wow. In this last piece, I, uh, I drew the tiniest little Emma that I could, that I could possibly manage. And uh, you probably already noticed, but the resemblance is pretty uncanny. I mean, look at that. Uh, it's outstanding. The pr printer scared me here. <laughs> it turned on and uh, it scared me. But anyways, that's all I got for you guys. Sorry if it was a disappointing episode three. Binocular astrophotography is pretty difficult. Especially if you don't know what you're doing like me. And, uh, I hope you guys have a, a good rest of your day or night or week. Uh, goodbye.